Check out this 2014 Carolina Skiff 258. It's brand new in July in January. And the seller decided he wants a different configuration. It's got a clear title on it. Everything looks really good. It's got a Suzuki 154 stroke, that's 2014 also. The seller installed these seats. There's cup holders next to the rear seating. Those pop up. It's got two live wells. This one, this rear one is also aerated. Storage in the back. There's a jack plate and a 10 foot power pull blade. Seller installed four of these extra rod holders. It's got a nice T top on it, beige color. Four rocket launchers back here and four back here also. More cup holders. Coleman cooler. Here's the seat slash leaning post. It's got foot rest and if you lift this up, it turns into a leaning post. Got a tilt steering wheel, hydraulic steering. There's a jack plate control and power pole, nice bar eight gauges. Got courtesy lights, live well lights, nav lights and all that. Got a Humminbird 998C GPS plotter and side imaging fish finder. Richie compass. Little windshield here. Metal's in great shape. A little storage under here. And also under under the seat. Lots of space on the side to walk through. And the front is really big and wide and open steps to get up to the casting deck. It's got a Minn Kota trolling motor that uh, that has a hand control and foot control however you want to use it. There's uh, plenty of storage up front and there's two batteries for the Minn Kota and a battery charger and there's two batteries two cranking batteries for the motor also. Here's the bow. Another seat installed up here. And the anchors in here. And the foot control. Yep. Railings through bolted cleats and you have a console seat here and an extra live well here. LED lights. have it. Pop Yachts International, true representations of vessels, 100 pictures is common, YouTube videos, fastest response time on the web. First showing called Jesse Dur